Hey guys, uh, today I'm gonna <clears throat> drill a hole into cement. Uh, I've that's really the first time I've done it. I've I just did the other column earlier, so I'm just videoing this one to show you how it's done. Um, got some of these Tapcon screws from Lowe's, and they're made for. These screws are made for cement. It came with the uh, came with this drill bit that's made to drill into concrete. So what I'm going to do is drill. I'm just going to drill two holes in here. I could do up to four for this column, but I'm just going to put down two on each column uh, just to keep the wind from blowing the gazebo away or tilting it or whatnot. So um, I'm gonna drill it and um, put in a screw and see how it goes. using a hammer drill that's um i think it's a lot works a lot better with cement if you just use a regular drill it'll probably take a lot longer so um I, if you have a hammer drill definitely use it and uh, i think i got down to what i need to get down to for the screw the screw is about um oh yeah this is a two and two and three fourth inch screw so I just want to get it down to that depth uh, to be able to catch it and hold on to it and go a little bit further down second hole it's over here Sometimes it's good to take it out in the middle and clear off the debris, make sure none of it falls in the hole so it doesn't make your job harder. And I definitely would recommend wearing safety goggles just in case this drill snaps, which has happened to me before. I don't know.
it really helped to go on the super high speed and put some pressure on the back of the drill. You see on our last part, it, it really cut through pretty easily. Good. All right, I gotta put the column back in place. the Tapcon cement screw. And I'm gonna use a socket wrench to crank it down. It's uh, pretty tight. It takes quite a bit of force to crank it down, which is good because that means it'll be hard to come off too. Finishing off the last screw, the second screw, the last screw. Finish tightening this up. The screw head is uh, 
This one was a eight millimeter. So I need an eight millimeter uh, size socket. Okay, that's pretty cranked in. Got the washer there. There you go. Very, very solid. It's gonna keep this gazebo from blowing around. 